Good morning, it's Mike Sorg with a bonus. It's a fifth one. I'm trying this. We're having five this week. Um, playing with it. We might, you know, obviously the reason uh, Sorgatron.com, at Sorgatron on the Twitter. Um, just want to kind of expand out about what's going on and uh, kind of the evolution of a web series, evolution of an online series, evolution of a podcast kind of popped in my head uh, lately. Um, uh, a couple things going on. Uh, I've been really, really pushing on this video thing um, lately. I've, I've found myself with the time, and uh, I want to, you know, one of the big things all the way back to my schooling days at the Artist 2 was content is king, content is king, that I've heard so many times, and um, and I'm really focusing on content. As Jug was telling the other day, how my, my blog has turned into a video blog. Hi, you're here. How you doing? And, or audio, which is fine. And I'm trying to make sure that we still serve the audio listeners that that, that were listening to this off, right off the bat. Um, in the case of some of the other stuff, like the wrestling shows, which has been, you know, I'm trying to, you know, again, kind of turn this into this into a, you know, money making side of the business, you know, a little bit with the podcasting work on the businessy side of things, but I also have to continue making things too, right? I have to continue making content. I have to continue making reasons for people to go check it out. Go check out this network of shows and and be introduced to multiple entry points, right? Hopefully somebody randomly finds a my discussion about the future from yesterday and uh, decides, hey, what else is this guy talking about? Is is kind of the idea, right? Uh, and uh, what do we do with that? So 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 wrestling mayhem show has always been kind of the flagship idea of of all this stuff. Uh, you know. It, We've been doing that for nine years. How many times has the show itself changed? And then uh, early last year, we said, well, okay, let's do these interviews. And then, and then everybody on the show was uh, just such an amazing crew. Uh, you know, to, to, to look at a show like that, that we do, that everybody's into. And um, sometimes when I find myself saying, oh, why do I do this? You know, before I, I was looking at, you know, kind of the business potential of any of this stuff was, oh, why am I doing this? Like, I'm, I'm doing this. I'm not getting paid for this. But, you know, I love doing it. And it seems to, it seems to, it does attract people. Um, attracts friends, you know. Attracts people to converse on a certain level about professional wrestling, of all things. The most ridiculous thing, you know, to talk about. Let's be honest. It's pro wrestling. It's stupid. And I'm the first to admit it, and I love it, and I can't stop, right? And so many of us can't, you know. I'll sit there on shows with guys who are wrestlers. I'm like, like, yeah, you know, this is like the stupidest concept for any of us to be involved in, you know. Like we're watching, and you're in there in tights, uh, the fake fighting, you know, when you boil it down. Anyways, that's a whole other conversation. <laughs> <laughs> but I love it. I don't mean it in a demeaning way. I, I, I mean it in a loving way, you know, um, you know, just as much as the same way as like, I still love cartoons. Sure. Yeah. You know. um, but anyways, the point, but these guys have grown around the show. We just had a new guy on the show this week. Who's a actually supporter. Like the guy gives us money through Patreon, uh, at the, the wrestling mayhem show, Patreon account. Um, and another one who I've only conversed with on Twitter and emails, um, is now giving us, you know, $5 a show, you know, it's tremendous. And we've expanded out and we're like, okay, we have something here. Um, the guys have, have taken on Google hangout, which I've always said was like a mini version of what I do here. You can do most of what I do here in this $50 studio, as I like to call it, uh, with all this stuff and all the technical glitches and everything that I do in Google hangout for the most part. And so the guys are doing it. The guys are getting on. After Monday Night Raw, after Total Divas, after after uh, all the shows that happened in the middle of the week, NXT, SmackDown, Lucha Underground, Impact when I was around there, um, and working on new concept. They, they did a game show, a wrestling game show for a while that they were playing with. They're doing these wrap-up parties, kind of a mystery science commentary track kind of thing to, to, to wrestling matches. They get to expand without having to be here in the studio, here in Beachview, lovely Beachview. Right down the way from Slice on Broadway. Sponsor. Um, and, and it is a beautiful, beautiful thing. And, and, and I'm trying to do my part as well. Because I do have the studio. And I feel like I haven't been utilizing it enough. 
I come down here every morning and start doing the show. We start expanding it out, doing the same for Awesome Cast for a Wrestling Mayhem show. Um, and to the point where, and even I, I, I tacked on this other thing where I'm like, you know what, I want, personally, I want to watch all the WrestleManias before the next WrestleMania. I was looked at as like 35 days at the last pay-per-view. 35 days. There's 30 WrestleManias. I can do this. And, and, and again, it's putting it on while while I'm working. I'm not, you know, in, invested, enveloped in it. It's just something I put on. I'm going to have something on or podcasts or something on in the background while I'm working away at social media or, or something until I have to get into some deep editing. Um, and uh, and that's more content, you know, uh, the daily thing. The, the you know, And then, you know, somebody's saying, hey, I did the wrap up. But, you know, oh, cool, we'll put it up to the point where that entire front page of that site is stuff from this past week. I realized that. I need to make the front page bigger or reorganize it or something. Actually, I, re- I need to redesign on half of my websites. So if anybody knows good WordPress and, you know, just love doing it, let me know. Because, yeah, we're not, we don't have the income on that yet. But I want to one day, actually, just to hire a designer and be like, take care of it. Not going to do it myself. Concentrate on this stuff over here. Anyways, that's, that's a whole other discussion for another podcast their morning but even developing this show what is this show it started off just like hey guys i don't know if anybody's listening but um i don't know um i think um stuff's cool and we're gonna talk about it to you know deciding this is gonna be supplemental content for the other sites if i talk talk about technology we're gonna share that over awesome cast if if i talk about video games i'm gonna share that over to insert coin to begin and same with awesome cast when i talk about a lot of video games on there and that's my platform and great, it's stuff that I can add on to Insert Coin and hopefully draw some more people in there. Um, and those guys doing a great job of content over there too. Um, and that kind of development and and making the content. So I'm focused on making the content, and I have thankfully people to help me focus on the you know us extraneous things, and I'm working on that and getting the word out um, because uh, you know sometimes I think you need to definitely look at. Your limitations, you know. I've classically always wanted to do everything myself. Atlanta RP take over little aspects, you know, that that you know I'm not good at this part, communicating with companies in a certain way, or or or, or reaching out to people and asking for something like this, you know. Um, and uh, it, it's important. And it's really cool when I realize, oh, this person is. I wonder if they can do this, you know. And uh, hopefully, share all of the benefits, you know. But uh, but even like, you know, as far as the show, I had a great. So I named this show the Good Morning Show for a lack of concept, for lack for somewhere to start from. Um, and now I'm looking and really, geez, we've been doing so long, I think since the summer. So we'll have a year anniversary at some point here. And uh, somebody, somebody, <laughs> chance second on the Twitter's. Um, hit me up a lot. We we're talking about something, and he said something about dropping basic sorgonomics, or or said that th- I did not say dropping basic sorgonomics in the middle of this thread. Which I don't know. I kind of like that name. Maybe that's what we'll call this from now on. Maybe I'll start that next week. Maybe I need a new graphic. It's it's a template in Final Cut, guys. It's not going to be hard for me to do that. Although you should get a different one because that doesn't really fit with that whole wood kind of grain in my jazzy up-tempo intro and outro music that I found on YouTube. Um, but you don't know what it's going to become and it's going to turn into. Um, the, didn't know the Wrestling Mayhem show would turn into me quitting my job and being independent and being that independent feast or famine flux of freelancing, which has been an interesting roller coaster. Um, but I wouldn't trade it for anything, certainly. I've talked about that here on uh, before. So, evolution of a podcast. What have you worked on has become something that, something totally different. How have you grown? Or do you do the same thing that you did 10 years ago? Five years ago? Last month? Yesterday? Um, let me know what you think. Let me, what do you think about, okay, this is kind of a, it, it help me validate myself, maybe request, but hit me up. Let me know what you think about the evolutions of this show or any other projects I've been doing lately. You know, I, uh, 
I don't get any critique feedback a lot. And maybe I'll just open the door to that at this point. Um, you know, I, I get a lot of, wow, you do so much. And wow, you're everywhere. Wow, you're doing this. And um, I don't get a lot of, yeah, you should fix that thing. <laughs> I just kind of go. And um, yeah, I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to level that as a kind of more personalized question there. Let me know what you think about the evolution of what's going on here. Let me know uh, uh, anything like that. Uh, I'm at Sorgatron on the Twitter. Talk to me on the comments to this YouTube video or anywhere else you might find this. If you're on iTunes and such, please rate us on there as well. That'd, that'd be really cool of you. Until next time, have a good morning. This show is a member of the Sorgatron Media Podcast Network. Find out more at sorgatronmedia.com.